Since 2007, IDC has covered the continuing evolution of the third platform and the ensuing impact it has had on the IT marketplace from the supplier, buyer, and consumer perspectives. At IDC, we expect that the third platform will be a leading driver and force of innovation across a period spanning more than 20 years. As such, IDC has identified three major chapters of evolution across the third platform. By examining each of these three chapters, we can plot out the major milestones that have shaped and will continue to shape the evolution of these technologies and their transformation of modern business and everyday life. The first chapter, which began in 2007, was the era of experimentation. This chapter saw the emergence of the major third platform technologies, cloud, big data, social, and mobile. However, these technologies were not highly integrated, and single point products forced customers to be the systems integrator. In fact, the vast majority of products and platforms at this time were not highly connected, and the data generated by these applications could initially not be easily moved across platforms. This siloed approach to platforms, ecosystems, and data led to specialized work styles where users became skilled in specific platforms. Customers in the first chapter had the opportunity to become empowered in new ways. It was in this chapter of experimentation that we first learned about social participation and the value of connection and voices on social. We saw the power of ubiquitous mobile connectivity and the new ways to gain insights with analytics at the departmental level. Around 2015, the shift to the second chapter of multiplied innovation began. Here, the silos started breaking down and technologies were combined and recombined to create new value. The third platform technologies created in the first chapter had matured at this point, and platforms to support and expand their reach were developed. Innovation accelerator technologies, such as 3D printing, the Internet of Things, cognitive and augmented and virtual reality, robotics, next generation security, were also being built around the foundational four pillar technologies during this time, expanding their use cases and value. One of the most drastic changes in the second chapter comes from an increased ease in sharing data and information. Data is now more easily shared and analyzed, which makes it valuable in its own right. Data as a service also starts to emerge in this chapter, creating new ways for data to be analyzed and monetized. Silo breakdown also means that third platform technologies are radically changing how workers complete their roles. Technology starts to augment skills and tasks that historically were not technology enabled. Technology is becoming more transparent, integrated, and natural to use. And looking ahead to 2023 and beyond, IDC sees the third chapter of the third platform as the era of autonomy. With advanced optics, voice recognition, robotics, blockchain, and large-scale technology miniaturization becoming the most distinctive traits of this chapter. More autonomous product innovation means shorter product development cycles and new ways to potentially increase efficiency. Whereas in the second chapter, technology sought to augment worker skills, here in the third chapter, machines will become self-learning. These advances drive more autonomous and accurate predictive decision-making freeing up human labor to be used increasingly as supervisors rather than workers in many roles that in the past have not been effectively automated. For consumers, technology is less visible in the third chapter, effectively integrated into and across experiences. Consumer technology is omnipresent, highly intelligent and anticipative of deeply understood consumer preferences. With autonomy, consumer technology is not just a conduit of communication and entertainment, but also of health and wellness initiatives. Now technology not only creates new experiences, but it's used to prolong and improve the quality of life. 
I encourage you to visit our website to learn more about IDC's third platform research and look for more content as we share additional insights and analysis on key trends shaping today's digital economy.